Hey guys, happy Monday. Mondays are so hard for me. They're like the hardest day of the week. Um, you know that saying, never miss a Monday and um, you know, have a good Monday. It sets the tone for the rest of the week. I truly believe that. I always say it on my Instagram because it's true. When I have a lazy Monday, Tuesdays are harder and Wednesdays are harder. It's just harder to start getting into the groove of eating healthy and having good workouts and stuff like that. But if I get a good Monday in where I'm very motivated and I get my stuff done, Tuesday seems easy, Wednesday seems easy, and so on. So, yeah, Mondays are the hardest. So, you know, my new friend, Kara, who I met last week, um, she was a follower and she's quickly become a friend. Um, we had discussed the next time we get together, we should do a workout. And so I asked her, what are you doing on Monday? Because for me, Mondays are the hardest and I often sleep in late because Let's face it, our weekends are busy. Our weekends are busy cleaning the house, going grocery shopping, so many errands. We meet up with friends, we stay up late. We're just exhausted. So for me, Mondays, if I don't do anything, if like I'm just home and I don't have to tutor anything, I end up sleeping in and then, okay, I'll work out after I eat. So I eat, oh, now I have to digest. And then while I'm digesting, I watch a show or edit a video and like, okay, just one more show or one more edit or 10 more minutes and it ends up being 10 o'clock and I'm like, oh shit. And then I'll just do like 10 squats and jump in the shower and go to bed. So I asked her if she was available this Monday because if I had the accountability of someone coming here to work out with me and I had to wake up this morning early and get ready and everything, then I knew that like I would do it and that's great so I'm excited she should be here soon so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna have a good workout and I guarantee if she wasn't coming I'd still be in bed at this time probably but you know I tidied up the house I got my workout gear on I had a protein shake and a banana and now I'm ready and now I'm ready and I'm gonna work out and then after I think we're gonna chill and talk maybe watch a movie and I was thinking, what should we do for lunch? Like, should we order in? What could you pot, like what, what, what do you really order in? Even if you order in healthy food, it's not prepared the healthiest. There's always a lot of oil and a lot of salt. And I've been eating out a lot lately. And that's why, this is a whole other issue guys. So I went consistently out to restaurants so much the last couple of weeks that it showed like a nine pound gain on the scale. And I'm like, what? Obviously that's, you know, water retention and I feel bloated and stuff like that. But now we're like a week later and it still shows a five pound gain. And I'm like, but is that a real five pounds? I don't know, it's kind of scary. So I'm just like, okay scale, you just stay over there and I'll do my thing. and just keep going so I don't have like a mental breakdown. So I'm just trying to like, you know, ignore that and keep doing my thing. But, you know, I was making healthy food choices for the most part at the restaurants, but you know, you can tell it's not made the way you make it at home when you're trying to live a healthy lifestyle. It's just like doused in oil, a lot of sodium. So we decided to have a healthy snack parties. Like it's just gonna be a fun little like spread of really healthy and delicious snacks. And yeah, that's what we're gonna do. So she should be here soon and I'm gonna work out and I'm gonna take you along my day. They're here! Hi! <laughs> so this is Teresa and this Hi. is Kata, who you know, and we are gonna get our workout on. Are you excited? Very. 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 What are you guys planning to do? Uh, cardio. Some cardio. Cardio today. Some hey. weights. Yeah, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna do a little bit of weights. Upper yes. body. We've gotta lock up Oliver. He's not happy about this. No. Not really. Okay, we'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye.
workout and that was great. I did some weights and then I did the treadmill. Um, I walk, I don't walk fast. I go like maybe 2.5, 2.7 speed. But what I do is an incline of usually around eight. Sometimes I lower it, whatever. And that's what gets my heart rate going. And Teresa and Kara are just finishing their last set of weights. And then we're gonna go and eat, which is the most important part. So that was a really, really good workout. Um, Kata and Teresa are just downstairs uh, taking a shower in the change room. And now I'm gonna shower and then they'll be up and we get to eat. So this is our spread. We have watermelon and cherries and popcorn and hummus and tzatziki with lots of veggies and some pita bread. This looks delicious. You excited guys? So excited. Woo! So this is my plate. I have a mix of fruit and veggies and pita with homemade hummus, courtesy of Kata's husband. Thanks, Peter. Yeah, it's so good. And we made some microwave popcorn, a little bit of grapeseed oil and sea salt. It's gonna be delicious. I'm definitely having more than one plate, probably like two or three. Yummy. Yeah, right. 